NASA's latest mission launched this morning sends a robotic spacecraft to investigate one of Jupiter's moons. And 12 News journalist Gabriela Becerra explains how scientists at ASU played a big role in this mission. Five, four, four three, three, two, two one. one. Mission. And lift off. Scientists at Arizona State University are celebrating the launch of the Europa Clipper spacecraft. It is a robotic NASA planetary mission and it is going to go to Europa, which is one of the four planet-sized moons of Jupiter. Research professor David Williams says scientists already know Europa is a moon covered in icy crust with what appears to be salty liquid underneath its surface, but they want to know more. We're sending a new mission there that will be able to completely characterize the body, get lots of good modern data with a whole suite of instruments to understand the habitability. Could this moon actually be an abode for life? One of those instruments on board is the Europa Thermal Mission Imaging System, or eThemis, built by ASU Regents Professor Philip Christensen. The eThemis is an infrared camera that will measure the surface temperature of the moon. If there's any locations near the surface of Europa that are uh, emitting thermal radiation, this instrument will detect it. William says this information will open the door for future missions to Europa and answer decade-old questions. What is the depth of the liquid water ocean? What is the thickness of the icy crust? What compositions of materials are being ejected, possibly by geysers, uh, from the surface of Europa? But it'll be a while before they have their answers. The spacecraft is expected to reach Jupiter in 2030. It's going to do a uh, uh, sort of a tour through the solar system, doing several flybys for momentum boost to get it out to Jupiter. Gabriela Becerra, 12 News. It's amazing to think of an ocean crusted with ice on I some mysterious know, world, some I moon know, out there. Salty water. I just, I love how we're discovering all these new things. They just have to be patient because it's going to take five years for that thing to get there. It's a long trip. It is a long it's not trip. like going to Tempe. All right.